G'day. Here's a little mystery about braids. In order to make a braid, one usually takes three strands, connected at one end, say at the top here, the other three ends loose, and do the following. You take the rightmost strand, cross it over to the middle, bring the leftmost strand, then cross that to the middle, and then the rightmost and the leftmost, and you alternate. Down you go. And that makes, as we can see here, a nice, beautiful braid. So then, we made very good use there of those three ends at the bottom being absolutely loose and free. So using this object, which has three ends attached to the top and three ends attached to the bottom, should be quite objectionable. It should be impossible to braid this beast. In fact, uh, yep, no loose ends, can't do it. I just used a bit of felt here, cut two slits, and I'm trying to braid that, and I say, why bother trying? It can't be done. Because clearly, this object here does not exist. Hmm. There is a braid, three strands going all the way down with the bottom three ends still attached to each other. In fact, this is quite stable. I can tug it, it doesn't fall apart. In fact, it's quite beautiful. There are no twists in the individual strands. Each strand is basically facing forward. That's why I drew these black lines on it so you can see that. So there we are. There's a braid with no free ends, which clearly cannot exist, despite it being right there. There is a mystery.